A Redditor named SwiftFool41 starts freaking everyone out when he started posting his porch cam videos on the advice subreddit. He had a bad feeling about a random late night visitor and wanted to know what others thought he should do. The stranger gets out and knocks on the door after waiting for over two minutes in their car. He rings the doorbell and says something about a minute later, but he's looking down so it's hard to hear. The uploader of this video really wants to know what he says. Then he says something about being on the porch to someone on the phone, maybe just a friend, or perhaps an accomplice. On the porch right now. Reddit dismisses this as strange but not alarming. Maybe it was just somebody with a wrong address or something. But then, five days later, another porch cam video has them freaking out. Three more cars pull up late at night, and no one gets out for a really long time. Over 17 minutes to be precise. What they do, it's a different stranger than before, and what he does next is odd. He knocks on the door and immediately counts a fat wad of cash. What is he expecting to buy out here, and why roll three deep to get it? The uploader doesn't answer the door, and Reddit has been freaking out ever since. This was over two years ago and the mystery has yet to be solved, or even updated for that matter, so who knows what the outcome was. The adventurer Defids travels to an abandoned location in the deserts of Saudi Arabia in search of the paranormal. He and a friend hear strange and mysterious bumps coming from other rooms, and something just does not feel right at all. They split up and the noises just get worse until he spins around and sees the back of a man who is sitting down. The adventurer Defids runs down the hall to get his friend, and when they come back, the person is gone. He thinks he captured the person on camera again, this time moving incredibly fast as they were leaving. It happens in a split second, so I will play it a few times. <laughs> Look again up close. Is this a spirit like they claim? Or just their flashlight moving across some dust? I think probably the latter. Also, please translate the text if you can. Go away. A Reddit poster named Drexana13 catches an invisible watcher using nothing other than the face detection software of her Snapchat filter. She says she could feel someone breathing on her, and this does seem likely because more than once, the spirit gets as close as it can to her. <laughs> <laughs> and it's practically right on top of her as she backs into the elevator. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I think I panic attack. But is it really a teleporting apparition? Or a Snapchat mistaking the dark circular areas between these lights as eyes? I think it's up for debate, but this Redditor seems to have made up her mind. Oh, and one last thing. It may have climbed into the elevator with her. There's a white light here. That might be the reflection of her phone screen. But the movements don't quite match. So what do you think it is? Thank you so much for getting me to 5,000 subscribers on my Clips channel. If you want to support, please press that subscribe button. Let's get to 10,000 subscribers. Thank you.